Oh, sweetie, they're all gonna drop. Yeah. What a fool. Why do I have these books? Oh, you have some books too. Hello, my shiny maze. Hello, my besties. It is officially the end of the month, and you know what that means. Just give me a reason. We were gonna look at my TBR and see if I complete it or not, and I'm here with the person that created my TBR. Giant. I did not even record. Love, I just started. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Essentially, this video, I like go through the books mm -hmm. and I say which ones I read and which ones I did. Are you ready? Oh my god, right. now are you stretching? Alright, we can start over. No, we're not starting over! <laughs> also, if you guys didn't see Giant picking my TBR, go watch that video first. Or else this one won't make sense. Well, it might make sense, but it won't make dollars. <laughs> you get it? Nah, no, I got it. I didn't like it. <laughs> I didn't like it. Beepers wants to be in it too. Alright, we're here. First up. We agreed upon Gracie and the Grump, and by we agreed upon, I mean Giant forced it upon me. Did I read it, do you think? No. Oh. That would be correct! Ding, 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 ding! I didn't. I didn't. And here's the thing. Didn't even look at it, didn't even think about it. The issue with this book is that I love Mariana Zapata. I do. But... Like, the... the... Bad. Very bad. <laughs> <laughs> you should have read it. So, Gracie and the Grump... That's a no. Do you think I read this one? Unravel me. Yes. I did! How'd you know? Isn't that what you were filming? Yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I read Unravel Me, y'all. As you saw by the video, I read Unravel Me and... Hold on. I also read Unite Me. So I read both of the books in Shatter Me that I said I was gonna read. I fucking did that. So any of you out there that are saying, Oh, Mary never follows your DBR. Well, well, I read these. <laughs> the Wedding Crasher. Mia Sosa. Did I read this or not? No. Damn. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't even think about this one. I wanted to listen to this one. I remember that. I really wanted to listen to it on audiobook, and I know it's a Brazilian MC, so I really wanted to get to it. But I just, like, wasn't in the mood. So I didn't read The Wedding Crasher. TBR, too. Larry, also, too, though, because I read uh, Shatter Me and Unite Me. So. <laughs> daughter of No Worlds, or as Giant likes to call it, Daughter of No Words. One time. Huh? That's only one time. Yeah, and, and it's been stuck in stone now. Is that how you say that? Set in stone? Set in stone. <laughs> the issue with this is I got so busy reading another fantasy book that I didn't get around to this one. But I really wanted to, to be honest. It begins with two souls who find themselves suddenly, utterly, alone. It's my stomach. <laughs> yeah, did you hear that? <laughs> I'm hungry. I did not read Daughter of No Worlds. Sorry, Sarah. I kind of want to read The Serpent and the Wings first, though. That's the issue, is I'm excited about that book by Carissa, and I'm not as excited about this one. So I think that that's why I just didn't find an intensive in 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 incentive. incentive to read it. But I will one day. It just that day was not today. What is that? Yes. Fourth Wing. I did read Fourth Wing. Not only did I read it, but I absolutely fucking loved it. If you want to see the vlog, go watch it. It's non-spoiler. I adored everything about this. So I have absolutely zero complaints. I am so glad I read it. And I think this is what I was so caught up with this month. I got really, really invested in Fourth Wing and then I physically couldn't do anything else. Rock, paper, scissors? Yes. Yes! How are you so good at these? Because we live together, so I see what you're reading. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the fact that you actually remember. I have a good memory. Good job! <laughs> I just graduated from law school not knowing nothing. Okay. I can't remember nothing. I read it. That's right. Rock, paper, scissors. I read it. Let's play one game of rock, paper, scissors in honor of me reading this. Rock, paper, scissors. Shoot, not even looking. One. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I read rock, paper, scissors. This was one of the thrillers I read. This was actually something I read right at the beginning of the month, I'm pretty sure. Um, by Alice Feeney, my first Alice Feeney book. Wow, I'm actually not doing so bad, let's be honest. Like, let's be honest for a second. What do you usually do? Horrible. So not bad is better than horrible. Yeah. Three Swedish mountain men. No. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's right, I did. <laughs> <coughs> good? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So I um did not read three Swedish men. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god, I've been wheezing so much lately. Why? 
funny. The Predator. I want to explain something about this one. I didn't technically read it yet, but I started it. I literally am listening to it, but I like didn't have a lot of time to listen to audiobooks this month. And so I didn't finish it yet. I swear I'm reading it. So I get a little bit of points for starting this one on audio. I just have not finished. So I'm giving it to me because I'm the judge here. And therefore I say yes. Secret Society of Irrelevant Witches. Secret Society of Irrelevant Witches. No. Yeah, I did not read it. I honestly didn't even. <laughs> Secret Society of Irregular Witches is what I said at first. I never said irrelevant, not me, not I. I did not read this. And this one was one of those that I didn't even look at. Like I don't even have an explanation for you. No excuse, didn't read it, didn't touch it, didn't even look at it. It just stayed on my shelf every single day of the month. And I've heard this book is really good. It just wasn't its time. Secret Society of Irregular Witches. It was so secret that I couldn't find it. It's like the puns are just like not hitting with you. And why? And why? Wrong place, wrong time. Another one that I started. I'm in the middle of the audiobook as well. I'm in the middle of two audiobooks and it's The Predator and Wrong Place, Wrong Time. I started this when we were literally with your parents during graduation, but I haven't finished yet because then I got busy and then I just didn't finish. But I kid you not, I started like only five chapters or so. I only got to the beginning of the book. I'm still gonna give it to me because I, I did start it. Wrong place, wrong time. More like right place, right time. Okay, you make a better pun. Here we go. Vicious. No. Make the pun. No. <laughs> I didn't read Vicious. That was my favorite one. Yeah. It'll be there again in June. No, it won't. <laughs> I didn't do Vicious. Damn. Okay, but wait. Hold on. Wait a damn minute because I'm going to count how many I read and how many I didn't. Hold on. Ready? Ready? Didn't. Didn't. <laughs> Wait a damn minute, y'all. I didn't read these. And I did read these. Un, dos, tres, quatro, cinco, seis. Oh my god! I read six and didn't read six, so I got a 50% this month. Assuming you're counting the ones you didn't read. That you started. Yeah, but I started them. So you count, right? They count, because I started them. To be read the book or to be read the first chapter? <laughs> <laughs> to be read the book. But since I started it, the book is gonna be read. You know what I mean? Because I started it. It's not like it's gonna sit on my shelf forever. I'm gonna finish it next month. I just didn't have time to finish it. But I did start them. So I say I still give it to me. So are you still reading them or did you pause? No, I'm still reading them. I'm still listening. So look at this. Oh my God. I literally read six books out of my TBR. Two of them I, I haven't finished, but I'm, I'm on it. And then these are the ones I didn't even touch. 50%. I need everyone to take a moment and to be very proud of me because I have I have never done this. The only TBR I've ever finished was last year, June. I know y'all remember June. I remember June very clearly. I read my entire TBR. I read all 20 books that I put on so it. You should do this June. Finish this June's TBR. You're right. That would be so fun and cute and amazing. Love put vicious away. <laughs> Stop being vicious. Here. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are. What would you give me? What grade would you give me? I mean, if we're going by school, 50% is an F. No, but like how hard I tried, you know? So I get an A. You get a B. I get a B. I'm gonna live with that. Minus, because you didn't read vicious. Okay, B minus. Woohoo! <laughs> Everybody say thank you, Giant, for being in the video. What a lad. <laughs> I love you.